Hello. Welcome to Harrow School. Are you sitting comfortably? Here at Harrow School, we believe in serious study and serious fun. And we hope that your time on the Harrow School's short courses will be seriously fun and seriously studious. However, like any school, there are rules. Break the rules and you will be punished. Continue to do so, you will miss an activity. Your parents may be informed, you might even be sent home. Here are the staff to tell you all about our rules. Rule number one. Go to all meals, classes, activities, <laughs> and excursions on your course on time. Rule number two. Make sure to keep your room tidy and remember to make your bed. Rule number three. Be careful with school buildings and equipment. Your parents will have to pay for the damage. Rule number four. No alcohol, no drugs, and no smoking. Rule number five. Girls aren't allowed in boys' houses. Boys aren't allowed in girls' houses. Simples. Unless you got permission first. Rule number six. Be nice to everybody. No bullying. Rule number seven. Be in your room by the time your house parent tells you to. And rule number eight. Please keep your phones switched off during classes and activities, otherwise these will be taken off you. Ah, change of scenery. Well, this is the room where the magic happens. Harry Potter reference, if you know. You know. Now, there is a system in place that if you break the rules, there are certain punishments. Firstly, there is a verbal warning, nice and polite, given most likely by your activities leader, just stating your behaviour has been noted to be not quite good enough. Please improve, nothing more need happen. Should that persist, however, you will be given a level one. That is stated, most likely by your activities leader or house parent. Your behaviour is not good. It needs to improve. This is a formal warning telling you to do so. Now hopefully that will be enough and we need not go any further. Level two. This is serious. Should your behaviour from level one continue, you will be put on a level two. Or, should you break one of the more serious rules straight away, you may immediately get placed on a level two. The centre director or the director of studies will bring you in and have a little chat. Your parents will be informed. You may be threatened with missing an excursion. Don't get a level two. Level three. This is serious. Either you have persistently, continually, done those things which you have told not to do in your level one or two, or you have done something so serious, you have broken such a major rule that you have been put straight onto a level three. The center director and the director of studies will speak to you together. Your parents will once more be informed and you will miss an excursion or something else you find fun. Continue to do so 
and you will be sent home. I suggest you don't do that. Oh. One last thing. Do have fun. That's an order. <laughs> <laughs>